little too loud at some points, but sorry. I like it. This is an update for my Victorian necklace. As you can see it on, I wanted to show you what it looks like on. I got my earrings out of the way. I love it. It came out nice. I like where it ends. The last bead doesn't get caught down and disappear down my cleavage. <laughs> so I'm really happy with it. I think that um, anybody else would like it too. So if you haven't seen my jewelry tutorial video for making this particular necklace, go check it out. It's my jewelry tutorial playlist. I'll also put the link for it down below. And while you're there, you might as well go check out my other videos in my tutorials, uh, in my jewelry tutorials playlist. So you might see something new from the neck. But I really like it. I just wanted to show you what it looked like on because I just showed you from the neck down. And so I wanted you to see, you know, what it looks like when it's on. Now I can put my hair up and then have that Victorian necklace going, <laughs> you know, get myself looking really Victorian and have my hair up in one of those ways they wear it and have this. I love it. I think I'm going to make another one, but I have to find a center. Maybe a red one or a green one. I don't know, but I know i got to make another one. So I need a lot of red beads I have to go get. But I'm very, very happy with this. And it took some time basically stringing the beads up because you're not really using string, you're using wire, and you got to do ends and end and end, and you're going to hook them all up to uh, jump ring. So it can be a little time consuming, but you'll have to do all that prep first and then put it together. But I did it as I was doing it so I can show you on the jewelry tutorial. So I hope that you watch that. And if you have any questions about that jewelry tutorial, any questions about how to make this, please ask me in the comment section, whether it's here or the jewelry tutorial for this particular next And I'll try to get back to you as soon as I can. I do check my comment section as much as possible throughout the day. And I try to answer all the time. So I hope you enjoyed this short little uh, update on this necklace and I'll be having more jewelry tutorials. So if you're not subscribed, subscribe now and click that bell for future notifications so you know when I'm uploading new content. And I will see you in my videos. Happy holidays. Bye. Mm -hmm.